Community Conversation today, we're joined by Sheila Sparks with Charlottesville City Schools. She's sitting down with Casey. All right, thank you so much, Steve. Thank you so much for being here with us today. Thank you for having me. Yes, we are happy to have you. And we are talking about preschool. Um, it's already that time to start signing up. How old does a child need to be to attend Charlottesville City Preschool programs? And is transportation provided? Great question. Our preschool programs serve children who will turn three or four by September 30th. Okay. So now is the time to apply if your children are in that age bracket. We do provide transportation outside of our walk zone. So as we know, Charlottesville has had walk zones this year um, and that will likely continue next year. All right, sounds good. Um, where can families go if they want to apply for Charlottesville City Preschool? So you can go to any elementary school office, but we also have an online application at go2grow.com. Awesome, go2grow.com. Um, what, uh, if people can't apply online, how can they find an application? So they are welcome to call any of our school offices. Um, we, we can get them a paper application. We can bring a computer and help them apply online. Uh, we wanna help families so they can call our office. My cell phone number is 531-5920. We will, we will make sure that people can, can connect. Awesome, so a lot of different ways to help people mm -hmm. and get those in. Um, when do you start accepting students for the fall? We will likely be no, um, notifying families May 1st. Oh, wow. Um, so right around the corner, yeah. so get those applications in now. Because That's hard it's, to believe. It's yeah. time. Yeah, it yeah. is time now. Uh, anything else that you think people need to know about the program? I think it's really important for families to know that our three and four year old program um, are on the same school schedule as the K to four uh, classrooms as well. So they're on the same schedule as older brothers and sisters. I think that's important for families uh, to know. Um, we also need proof of address and proof of household income because those are two of the big criteria. So I think that's important to get those documents turned in when they complete the application. Yeah, yeah, sounds great. Anything else you wanna add real quick before we go today? Um, I think it's important if families are concerned uh, or have questions to contact us and talk to us um, about what those concerns are because we do want to make sure that every family feels comfortable and uh, get their children off on the right start. Awesome, and one more time, what's that website? www go to grow.com. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much for being here with us today. Thank you. Yep, we'll have you back soon. And Steve, back to you.